as for the interior, it is a non-smoker. It's very, very clean. I always want to try to find something to like nitpick or notate. And so if I had to do anything, there'd be a little scuff right here on the steering wheel. I know this is very minimal, but you know, there's a couple little scuffs there in the cup holder. And then this little compartment here, there's a couple little scuffs on the leather. But I mean, really, that's all I could find. It's a very, very clean interior. Okay, and for the last part of the video, I'm gonna do a quick visual condition report. And before I get started, this entire front hood, front bumper, carbon fiber splitter, and these rear quarter panel slats here are all wrapped in paint protection film. And so that has done a phenomenal job at protecting this car from any type of rock chips and road debris. There are a couple imperfections here and there, and so I'm gonna notate those. So like I said, this entire section right here, all the way up to this body line, all the way back and around the curve here is wrapped in paint protection film. So it's done a good job at protecting it. This is a section here that has sustained some rock debris and damage, but it's not through the paint. I think it's just here in the paint protection film. And so it's done a good job at protecting this little quarter panel section. Here on this gloss black section, we do have a small little scuff. And then we have a really, really small chip in the paint right here. And then on the carbon fiber mirror covers, there's a tiny, tiny little chip right there. And then there may be one or two little rock chips that might have got through on this paint protection film, but nothing's really standing out. So this carbon fiber splitter is in really good condition on everything that you can see from just standing right here. But if you go under just a little bit here on this edge, it has a little bit of rash, but you really can't see it from a foot and above. So overall, this car is really, really clean inside and out, and it looks like it's really well taken care of. If you have any other questions, give us a shout at Exotic Motorsports of Oklahoma, and I'm going to put the link down in the description. Thanks, guys, and have a good one.